okay so my um favorite erasers and sharpeners that i use all of the time we have my faber castell kneadable eraser um, i have these on subscription from amazon because they go missing all of the time wonderful for just making textury marks and cleaning things up i have my scotch magic tape um, and it really is magic it's fantastic again for getting little marks off paint off um, off the paper and also for creating really lovely texture and highlights it's sticky on one side and smooth on the other and i literally just lay it over my pigment and um, i just draw on the top of it and i bring out uh, little highlights and everything just got to be careful in the early layers it will take off quite a lot around it as well but once you get lots of layers in it works brilliantly um, then I have my Tombow, uh, very grubby looking little Tombow here. <laughs> it's like a mechanical pencil. You just have the little tiny eraser uh, uh, refill, um, which you can um, you can change. Great for tiny little uh, amendments and texture marks and that kind of thing. Then I have my slice tool. Um, I use it on drafting film mostly. Absolutely awesome for creating texture, whiskers, uh, fine details, that kind of thing. Um, and then onto my Swordfish Multipoint, my electric eraser. I couldn't live without this eraser. I absolutely love it. Literally just pop your pencil in and it sharpens it. <laughs> and for a lazy artist like me, it's absolutely brilliant. I literally just sit there, zoomy zoomy, and that's it, done. Um, wonderful absolutely wonderful sharpener honestly I can't I can't recommend this highly enough um, I then have my other little handheld sharpener uh, this is the uh, cum magnesium handheld sharpener very cheap little sharpener but incredibly good it's about two pounds fifty something like that again I buy a few of them because they, they can go missing with the dogs and everything um, and um, they sharpen really really nicely I tend to sharpen my softer pencils polychromos works beautifully in this but I tend to sharpen my softer pencils with this one just because I've got a little bit more control and I can sort of you know um, you know make sure that they're not going to break apparently you're supposed to twist the sharpener rather than the pencil i don't really understand that i tend to twist my pencil i'm not sure what um <laughs> i'm not sure what the difference makes but it's a really really super super little sharpener um so those are my go-to tools <laughs> 